Oh, look at what I got. Papa Drew got himself a new pair of shoes. Yeah, buddy. There you go. Papa Drew's new shoes. Dr. Scholl's. There you go. Brand new pair of shoes, boys. Yipper. Not a bad looking shoe either, so. I think it was about time, though. These were getting kind of ratted. Time for a new pair. So, yeah. Those were talking to me. So it's time for new shoes. I think my cats love each other. <laughs> what are you doing to her, Fisher? What's the matter, Pix? Is Fisher getting to you? <laughs> Pix, where are you going? She says, I had enough of him. She had enough of you, Fisher. <laughs> You're all done. Yeah, you are. You're all done. <laughs> eh? You, my buddy, what's the matter? You all sad that she's gone now? You all sad that she's gone? Drop a pick in your nose? <laughs> you, buddy. You all sad that she's gone? Or are you happy that you got me all to yourself? I think it's more like you're happy that you got me all to yourself. You silly kittens. Hey, silly cat. Hey, Fisher. What do you say? Meow. Say hi, everybody on YouTube. Say hi, everybody. Okay, that's all. Hey, guys. This is going to be the main gate on the back. That's going to be the gate door. Curtis went a little bit overkill. He put like almost 200 screws into this thing. 60 yeah, but whatever. It's and a heavy, heavy it's duty. It's a 120 pound dog and that's an oversized tent. Yeah. I want three, uh, I want minimum three, maybe four hinges and at least triple lock and a self closer on it. Yeah. Anyways, that's going to be a heavy gate, but whether, either way, that's going to be the gate. We built it in here because simple reason in being, it's dark again. The last three nights in a row we've been giving her, but we got a little bit caught up, guys. I don't know how much you can see without the light. Come on, light. Turn on. There we go. I don't know how much you guys can see, but we got this part of the fence here done. And, uh, yeah. So that's the main one here. And then uh, the gate we just built is to cover from here to here. And here to here, basically, from between the two holes. And then this little piece here, I'll build a little piece to finish that off. And that'll be the back part done. And then we just got that front part over there to do. But like I say, you know, Curtis works till 6. And by the time he gets home and we have supper, I got that little corner to fill in over there too. But the, by the time he gets home and has supper, it's uh, pretty much dark. So we decided to do it inside the shop. Build it in here. And tomorrow during the day, Curtis is off tomorrow. So tomorrow, Curtis can finish that part of it, I guess. But uh, unfortunately, we came to a standstill today. Why? Because we're out of screws again. So that's what, three boxes like that already? Yeah, well, I knew I'd need way more. Yeah. I'd a quarter done, but they never had the thousand pack. They only had hundred packs. Yeah, so what so now? So I was going to go to Rona. Yeah, so. Now. Yeah, you can cut that off there at the back. I need to set up my jig where to run the saw to cut perfectly. Yeah, you set her up and then we'll go from there. Another way, I don't know. But anyway, we're going to cut that down for tonight and then we're pretty much going to call it a night for tonight because that's all we can do for tonight, so. Yeah. Okay, guys, that it ends wait, this wait, update wait. for now. Catch, how many of these screws am I going to catch if I run it across there? None. Yeah. They're all sunk in. Well, you better not catch any. Because if you're catching screws, that means you're cutting into the bottom frame. No, but I mean with the guard <laughs> here. Yeah, no, you won't catch any. Maybe in between it might hit. No. Should it? If it Shouldn't. Anyway, guys, that's it for tonight. We're going to call this the end of this part. I'm and cut this first. We'll add to this later. You mean a good girl. <laughs> Lazy puppy. I still got to pack these poles down when we're done. They're not packed down. Do you see how fast that closes, man? Yeah, how does it work? Well, you hit that uh, bump stop temporary. Temporary bump Otherwise stop, Otherwise, it yeah. hits that. That's right. Oh, yeah, that works.
Perfect. Oh, it bounced out. Bounced out. Oh, oh, is it going to latch? No. Nope. Uh, <laughs> it's because of this one. Yeah. Well, we got to put a lag bolt into the garage. Once we do that, then it'll line itself up better and latch better. Oh, yeah. It just pulls too It quick. works. But again, if the dog jumps and hits it bad. But that's it. Happen. What? I show them how the center goes. What, what do you mean center? The center, the big part that we can remove if we have to. Oh, well, yeah. We just, we're going to actually screw the drill these and screw them temp, uh, right now just to screw through here. Yeah, uh, just. But this is designed that we can actually lift and remove this whole center the section. The whole center section. To comes get out up. this moldy old car. Yeah. Comes free. So, there you go. She's all together. I guess I'll get a shot from the other side. Yeah, might as well. And we're not done yet because we still got to do the little one across there. Yeah, he's still got this end to do. That's the, tomorrow's project. This was the trickier one. So for tonight, this one's done. Oh yeah, how are you gonna get back in if I if you? Well, you're there. Yeah. Well, I was gonna come out too. Oh, that would be funny. Yeah, it would be. Yeah, I know. Hey. Yeah, we don't have a string on it yet, but so, hey, it's gonna have to work. So you do yours, then I'll do mine. I'll we'll close it. Let's see how pretty it is. Oh, just a little bit on the bottom. But that will be fixed once we lag bolt it. Just a little bit of a crook here. Yeah, until we get a... Well, once I put in the pulse. Okay. Give it, in. Give but it. you know something? I could probably wedge my knife through there and catch it because the cord's uh, a little loose. You got to let me in? Oh, Lee there, old man. I'm not letting you back yeah, in. Yeah, you way. better. i kick your butt. But anyway, there you go, guys. I only have to rip one board down, and that's right on this corner. Because I only need a four inch instead of a six inch. And I just use an old dirty board, but it don't matter. It's going up against this old fence anyway, so. But there you go. One fence installed. Ready to rock. We still gotta do the gravel along the bottom. We gotta fill in the gaps or whatever, but not too too bad. For now, for today, that's good enough. But anyways, so we're halfway done. We got one of the one out of the two fences done, so. Halfway mark, guys. That's it for now. Okay. So this back fence is pretty much complete now, guys. That one's done. Yeah, buddy. So today, what we did, this is for now, temporarily, is we moved all this stuff that we had to move over here. A bunch of old pipes and exhaust and everything. Just put it all over here for now just to get out of our way because it was all piled behind those bricks. And what we're doing is we're starting on this one. I still got to move these sidewalk stones here because these will be in our way here. We have to get rid of those, but I cleaned all back here so we got room to work. But look at this. An hour and a half already, and this is what we're digging out. Concrete. It looks like there must have been an old sidewalk underneath this sidewalk at one time. They busted it all up and threw it all here and right where we got to dig. So we've been digging out concrete for an hour and a half on the first hole already. So this might be a longer than one day project, <laughs> but we need to go from the house. We're putting one pole there. We'll put one pole right around there someday for the gate. And then one pole at the fence corner over there. And then, uh, yeah, we got three holes to dig. And the first one is being a real headache as we've been pulling chunks of concrete out of here. So Curtis has been working like crazy getting all this concrete out of there and trying to get this hole dug. So, and uh, basically the only other thing we could do is move locations, but because of the window well, we'd have to almost move back to the corner of the house if we go that way, and who knows what's there. So, we're just going to continue and fight it on and put it where we want it. So, anyways guys, that's your update for now. This is as far as we got, and uh, if we get, if we're lucky if we can get the three holes in today, by the looks of it. If we get the three holes dug today, I will be a happy camper. But it's going to be a long day, so there you go, guys. Just a quick update for you. Let you know what we've been up to. Yeah, we did. Got another mail call. Yeah, buddy. Well, Cab 7 said he was going to send me an American flag. But. Ah. Dang. Keep two hands. <laughs> Somebody beat him to it. There you go. So I got my American flag in the size I wanted. Thank you very much. And the note in there. Says. 
America! Oops. Enjoy. Hang it nice, Captain Jerk. So, this is who sent me the flag, Captain Jerk. Well, thank you, Captain Jerk. Justin, I really appreciate it. We'll get that hung up on the wall. And uh, I guess when I get the one from Ben, it'll be a bonus round. Thank you. There you go. We have the American flag up there. Thank you, Captain Jerk. I appreciate that, my friend. It's right next to my Canadian flag. Yeah, here we go. So we got the America flag. Thanks to Captain Jerk. I appreciate that much, buddy. Welcome to the Wall of Fame, Captain Jerk. <laughs> got the American flag, Canada flag, Nova Scotia flag, and Newfoundland flag. So there you go, guys. So she's up there. There are my flags. Doing good so far. Appreciate it. Thank you. So as you guys can see, it's starting to get a little bit dark outside already, but decided, oh yeah, time to do up some ribs. Just getting the barbecue ready to go here. Got everything laying here right now, the tools. Curtis takes the break, so it's supper time for break time. That's what we're going to do. And I'll show you guys where we're at. So, basically, you guys know this is all done on this side. But, uh, yeah, it's getting a bit dark. I don't know what you guys will be able to see on here, but, yeah, not too bad. We got that framed in there already. And the gate's going to be framed in there. And basically, we're going to frame in this. So, we took all our measurements because it's getting dark. And we're going to, like, I built this frame inside and brought it out here and it fit perfect. So, we're going to do the same thing for the gate. Same thing for that tonight, and then tomorrow we'll put all the boards on. So, it looks like she's going along pretty good. We ended up only having to dig like two fence posts there. And then in the corner, we just dug a 2x4 into the ground there. And then the same on this side here, we're going to put a 2x4 to match up to his fence, because we don't really need the 4x4s. So, she'll be good and solid, guys. And then it'll be blocked off. So, we're in the middle of the project, but decided to stop and wash my hands and make some supper for us because uh yeah we're getting pretty hungry and the dog's being lazy aren't you hey you being lazy you being lazy pup yeah you are but anyways we still got quite a bit of lumber there so we should be able to finish with what we have so and i think we got enough screws now right perhaps perhaps he says but anyways guys i'm gonna get this barbecue going and we'll take it from there so yeah, they're on the queue. Look at that, it's gonna be so good, guys. Gonna take uh, probably an hour or so to do them, but hey, it'll be well worth it. Yummy, yummy, coming up. That's it for now, guys. Oh, dick. I forgot to show you guys the finished product. There it is, in my belly. <laughs> uh, sorry, guys, I totally forgot. <laughs> oh well, it's done. I guess that's it for that one. Anyways, still got some building to do. As you can see, we're going to get back to work. So, Sorry, guys. Forgot to show you the finished product of the ribs. They look so good, I couldn't wait to eat them. <laughs> and man, were they tasty. <laughs> oh, well. Sorry, guys. So, Curtis is building the gate right now. Keep it straight. What do you say? I just keep it straight. Hey, I told you to draw me a line. You don't want a line? It's not my fence. It's going at your house. This is my fence. I'm using a chalk line. What? What do you want? <laughs> what do you want? He said, do you want to say hi to everybody? You want to say hi? Say hi, everybody on YouTube. Hi everybody! Yeah, what's Daddy doing over there? Hey, what's he doing? He building. Yeah, Grandpa's got a mess in his garage. Yeah, Grandpa's taking a break. You can come cuddle. You can come cuddle. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you want to cuddle Grandpa? Grandpa's girl. Daddy's making noises. Okay, so. Tricky's 
sweat. Getting tired yet? Oh, God, no. I just drank two cups of coffee. Can <laughs> yeah, sweat some of it out? So how are the ribs for supper? I forgot to show people the finished product I realized after. Well, they were edible. Yeah. But anyways, we're going to build up the this gate tonight. Tomorrow we'll hang the gate and hang the rest of the boards and go from there. So, Anyways, guys, that's a little bit of an update. Now we'll catch you in a bit. So we just finished the fence. She's already free and snoopy. But the fence is done, guys. There you go. New fence. Yeah, buddy. So Curtis just has to fill in underneath there and get all that piled in there for now. Well, I'm going to put this two sidewalk blocks here. Yeah, for now, yeah. It's kind of why I'm just laying this lightly for now. Oh, this old plywood that had... Yeah, I know, it's all junk. Bury it? Yeah, bury it, whatever. Well, you don't bury any cement blocks like they did to us. No, we're going to. Those ones are getting Are you stuck? <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on, Grandpa. Come check this one out. So there's our complete fence, guys. Fence there, fence there. The doggy. Yeah, so that's it. Fence is all done. We completed the job, man. She's done. That's all for now, folks. End of this story.